what we're going to do is we're going to configure the software to read a single stream from your PC, a single physical stream from your PC, and mount a file system. So the first thing we do is we go over to configuration on the menu bar and click on that. You see several options here. What we want to do is we want to read all the hard drives that are on your system. We do that by clicking on populate stream list. Click on that you notice I have four drives mounted. The drive that I want to take a look at is this drive right here. So we click on that, double click on it, and it actually mounts it into our stream set list. Once this is mounted into the stream set list, we want to click on this button so that the software acknowledges that we have this drive mounted into the stream set. Click on OK. The next thing we want to do is once we have our stream set designated, is that we want to scan for the volumes or search for the volumes that are within this stream set. So we go to Volume Tools, click on Search for File System Volumes, and you'll see this block counter start. Now we have one here, so now out of 119,234 blocks, we've scanned eight or searched 80 of them. What View It Now allows us to do is to interrupt the processing. We already have one here, so we can go up here, interrupt the processing, and now this is done, and this will allow us to work on this particular volume. So we click on the volume, we want to mount the volume. The message volume is mounted. The next thing we want to do is we want to tree the drive. So we want to tree the active volume. You see it right here, the blocks moving up, the files and folders that it's found. Once that's completed, you'll receive your standard explorer type file system display. That's it. This is quick start. This is for a single stream off a physical drive. There are many other options. You can do RAIDs, RAID 0, RAID 5. You can set reset offsets. You can add files. There's a lot of options with this and a lot of other things you can do. But this is only if you have a single drive that you want to scan.